Where'd Hiroko go? <laughs> Hello interwebs and welcome back. I'm Shanna and this is I share my life and stories and vision opinions and whatever else I feel like. And today we are back with another random Japan life vlog. In this particular vlog, there are some really significant things that happen. It is kind of the middle of February and I don't want to give too much away about what happens, but it's, it's pretty significant to my life and the virus and what happened in the world. So keep an eye out for that. But before we get into that, this one starts off with some wisdom tooth extraction. And for those of you who don't know, in Japan, when you get your wisdom teeth removed, you are not put under, you are not put on any like good drugs. You are given a local anesthetic and some ibuprofen to go home with. And that is it. And I already had two, my top two removed at this point. And so we are going in for the third extraction of one of my bottom teeth. And without too much rambling, let's go ahead and get into it. Good morning, guys. We are up early on a Saturday morning. I forgot my choker because I was in a rush. Because today we're going to go get another wisdom tooth removed. You can't tell because I have a mask on, but I'm smiling that smile where I'm like, yay, but not really. So, crash your fingers for me. All right, guys, so we're home. I look like hell. You can see if you just compare the sides of my face. This side is nice and good. This side is definitely a little swollen. It's not bad though. Hey, I'm gonna give a countdown and if you don't like blood, I would skip ahead to whatever timestamp I put here because there's gonna be blood in three, two, one. Um, okay, how? Gross. I'll put a warning before I show that. Um, but yeah, this is, we're not doing too bad. We're not too swollen. So, it definitely hurts though. I need to take some medicine. And then I'm gonna take a nap. Okay. It's got like jelly stuff in it. I like it. Hey guys, so I have been out all day today. I went and played Harry Potter Wizard Unite for Community Day in Osaka, and then hung out and did a lot of fortresses, and then went to karaoke with my friends, which may or may not have been the greatest idea given my dental surgery yesterday. However, um, you can see, let's look at my face, then my crusty lips, I'm sorry. Been a long day, I need some chapstick. Um, my face isn't too bad. I had a lot of salt and sugar, so I'm probably a little bit swollen in general. But I'm a little swollen over here. I can definitely feel it if I touch my face, but it's not too bad. It really does still hurt a lot, um, but it's better than it was yesterday, so that's good. Um, I probably should have given myself more of a break today, but I couldn't miss Wizard Unite Community Day, so... I'm gonna work on putting those videos up for the rest of tonight, and I will check in again tomorrow. But I think I think we're healing. I think we're doing good. Um, cross your fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Fixing your sock again. At the three gate. So Hiroko and I are checking out this special shrine. Hiroko, you want to tell them what it is? No. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. This is a quick reminder to let you guys know that you should hit that subscribe button if you haven't. And if you like the video at any point, go ahead and hit that like button as well. Sorry for the interruption. I'm going to shut up now and let's get back to the video. Well, I'll tell you guys what it is then. So Hiroko is telling me that you come here whenever you're wanting to sever a relationship with somebody and it's really bad and you hate them and you have to write your name on a piece of paper or not your name, their name <laughs> on a piece of paper and what you want want and then you can put it on this little dome thing that you have to crawl through or you can write on an Emma and be like I hate this person because they're my husband and I want them to die and apparently that's stuff that people really put on there so we're gonna check it out <laughs> we're trying to find somewhere to park my bike right now which I keep walking into okay Here's some of the Emma 
that people have written on. I can't read any of them. <laughs> Are there any really interesting ones, Hiroko? Any juicy drama? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess it doesn't have to be a person. It could be a sickness. Oh, okay. Mm. That makes sense, though. Yeah. Any, like, negative thing you kind of yeah. want to get rid of? Uh, work. Work. Mm. Work. That's a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> All, all the old the employees come here. I see good things here. too. Huh? I think I, I, I can see good things. Oh, too. really? Yes. Mm, that's good. Yeah. So it's not all bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lots of people got things they want to get rid of. PC. Apparently you have to go and come back. When you it's not just go, one way. You can end a bad relationship. Okay. And when you come back, you're gaining oh. a good relationship in the future. That's very symbolic. I like it. Okay. Interesting. Yuzu. We got... Cherry blossom rice cake, soy powder and brown sugar and syrup, matcha, plum, sugar, chocolate mint, green tea, coffee, black tea, yuzu. Mm. Who's that guy? <laughs> He's funny looking. <laughs> Is it gummy or gummy? Well, we call it gummy. Gummy. They sell gummy. Hmm? Mom. Oh, how cute! Cute. What a little souvenir. Look at it. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> It's so bigger big. than your head, Hiroko. <laughs> Where'd Hiroko go? <laughs> Hello. Follow me. So we got the hojicha. Hold up, hold up. Can you see me? All I see is cotton candy. <laughs> Hmm. Well, it's a candy. <laughs> but I mean, like, it could not taste like it, you know? <laughs> hey guys, so I thought this might be uh, worth documenting. Um, I'm just finished teaching my online classes and in the middle of teaching one of my students hadn't shown up yet and I was on Twitter got a notification from NHK that Abe might be canceling school for an unforeseen amount of time um, which means that tomorrow might be the last day of school and we were supposed to have like a good, or I was supposed to have a good week and a half left. The students were supposed to have about another two weeks, uh, two and a half weeks of school left. And I'm actually really, really upset about it um, because this is my last year with these kids. And I was, you know, looking forward to spending the last week with them and, you know, trying to enjoy that time. So it's really sudden to have to say bye to everybody. Um, but also, look at me getting upset about it. Um, maybe it's a good thing because then I don't have to cry in front of all the classes as I tell them bye. But I'm so sad. I hope that it's probably gonna happen because that's what they're saying is gonna happen. But that also means graduation is canceled. And like, I know it's stupid. I know a lot of people are probably happy about it, like as far as teachers 
and maybe even students go, um, because, you know, extra holiday or whatever. But I'm really sad about it. I love these students and I love seeing them even though it's exhausting. So, yeah, that's what's going on. Sorry I'm crying. I'm so sorry. I'm just really upset about it. But yeah, thought it would be worth documenting for whenever we get to this random Japan video. All right, I'll update you guys once we know more. I'm doing my best to stay positive. But uh, yeah, see you guys later. Spoiler alert guys, it happened. And yes, I was an absolute wreck. This was a very distressing situation for me. I was not prepared to say goodbye to everybody as early as I had to, but we worked with it the best we could and you'll find out more about that in some later vlogs. So let's get back into the rest of this one. Hey guys, so I'm leaving the dentist. They said everything looks good. My gums are still a little swollen, but that's normal. They were surprised by how well it's healed since I'm 30 years old. Um, I didn't realize that age made such a big difference, but apparently it does. So we'll be going to get the left side removed in about a week. Yay. One week later. All right, guys, we're doing it. We're going today. They're taking my final wisdom tooth. I know it too feels like I've been living at the dentist recently. And yes, I'm crossing the street illegally because I don't care. But yeah, final wisdom tooth time. Woo, wish me luck. So this particular extraction, the third one, which was on this side, ended up being the absolute worst of all three of my wisdom tooth removal surgeries. The top two, like I said, I had removed at the same time. Uh, it was fairly easy. It took long because he was doing two at the same time. I was terrified. I was crying. It was a, it was a whole thing. But the actual extraction and the healing process for that was fairly easy. But when I had my fourth one removed, my third one was still in quite a bit of pain and it also took way less time to have the fourth one removed than the third one even though the dentist thought the third one was going to be easier but this one the way it was impacted and then also if you looked at the root it kind of twisted around it was just really hard for him to get out so it took a little bit longer to heal as well but all was well and everything healed and it all worked out and we made it through that. So if you are in Japan and you have to have your wisdom teeth removed, please be prepared for this type of situation. Most of the time they don't even want to take more than one out at the same time. And he also told me that if I wanted to do the bottom two at the same time, I was gonna have to go to a dental surgeon at like a big hospital and have it done. So it would have been a totally different situation as well. And I didn't wanna do that. I wanted to do it with the dentist that I was comfortable with and I trusted. So that was the situation for me. As for school, like I said in the spoiler alert, it did end and very abruptly, but my adventures did not. And I will share with you my last day of school in a later vlog and some other things that happened as well and some more adventures that I went on. So until then, that pretty much wraps it up for this one. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And if you don't know what to comment down below, go ahead and leave some tooth emojis for the, the wisdom tooth removal, obviously. Not only does that help out my channel a lot, but it lets me know that you were here. It gives us a chance to chat. It lets me know you made it to the end of the video. And of course, I just love to see your faces down there. If you want another way to help out my channel down below, there'll be links to my website, my merch store, and my Patreon. There's zero obligation to check any of those out, but if you want to, you can. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I appreciate all of you so very much, and I will see you next time. Remember, stay Genki AF. I think I forgot to say that in the last video. Oh well. Stay Genki AF, guys. Bye. Oh, hello there. Yes, uh, this is me casually drinking from my Genki AF merch because uh, I don't have any bloopers to share. But if you like my cup or my shirt or some leggings or some socks, there's links in the description below. Be ginky as, and enjoy your coffee or tea or water or whatever else you like to drink from mugs. <laughs>